Welcome back to Pride. Today's video, we're going to be going over some advanced drills for shadow boxing. So most of the time for beginner boxers, you're more focusing on certain combinations and making your shadow boxing drills very strict and very limited to only certain movements because you're trying to perfect your technique. Once you feel comfortable with your technique and you've done a lot of these drills, you're going to notice you start shadow boxing real loose and just throwing random combinations and moving very randomly trying to rely on that muscle memory that you've created through those basic drills. Now this is a good sign. This means that you're ready to move on as an advanced boxer with your shadow boxing. So to take your shadow boxing to the next level, the first thing you want to focus on is high punch output. You're going to be all offense. You're going to be attacking, attacking, attacking. And number two, after that offense, you're going to want to be able to mix in some defense. So while you're on that high offense, throwing a high punch output, you want to be able to mix in certain blocks and movements and be able to react if your opponent counter punches. Now I'm going to show you some of these movements one at a time and then we'll mix them together. One at a time first, that way you really understand the block that I'm doing, the movement that I'm doing, and then we'll mix them together with shadow boxing. <laughs> So you're incorporating in a lot of defense with your offense. You're putting in a lot of counter shots. So you're throwing your punches. Your opponent throws a punch. You got to block and then counter his counter, okay? So it's back and forth. You're moving steps ahead. And you're really shadow boxing as an advanced boxer. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to add this to your training. You're going to really feel the benefits of shadow boxing this way. And keeping defense in mind. Be sure to subscribe to Prime Martial Arts, turn on notifications for all future videos.